Hey there everybody, I am at Olsen Power Equipment today. It is in North Branch, Minnesota, and I brought my tractor with me because it has the premium cab on it. But this one next to it does not have the premium cab. It has what is called the standard cab, or what is also known as the Curtis Advantage Series cab. Both of these cabs will keep you warm. In fact, there are options for both of these cabs to put air conditioning on, so that is also an option. But one has more features than the other one does. So I'm gonna show you some of the differences uh, because there's also price differences. So if you're considering, you know, premium deluxe model cab, that's an option for you. If you want something that doesn't have all the bells and whistles but still keeps you warm, you know, still keeps you smiling in the winter time and maybe in the summertime if you want that air conditioning, that might be a great option for you as well. So I'm having a lot of fun here at Olsen Power Equipment, and I'm gonna tell you a little bit more about these cabs. All right, my cab, which is the premium cab, has been awesome this winter. I have enjoyed every minute of plowing snow in the comfort of a warm cab. So I'm going to show you a little bit more about it. It's got a side window that opens both directions. It is fantastic for talking to people who want to come up and say thank you for plowing my driveway or hand you cookies or brownies. It is just the perfect access window for that. So as you can see the heater of this cab spans all the way from left to right and has a total of four vents. One up here, one down here on each side. And you can turn and spin those so you might want to defrost your windshield uh, in the wintertime. And uh, you can stay nice and warm by turning these any direction you want. Another difference is this cab has a window that will open because as you know the 80 series has levers on the loader which allow you to remove it right from right from your operator's area. Another difference is because I have the BX23S, I have a backhoe, I just don't have the backhoe attached, but this back panel will actually come off of the tractor and it's real super easy. It's just, you flip this lever on this side, there's another one over there, you flip them open and that thing comes off, piece of cake. And it'll allow me to rotate this seat all the way around 180 degrees so I can operate the backhoe. Now because it's the backhoe model, the roof pops up. And you can just leave the roof popped up in the summertime if it's too hot for you and let a little more air ventilation in. Uh, but because it's the backhoe model, it has that feature where the roof pops up and the back panel comes off. However, the BX2380 and the 1880 have a similar cab to this. The only difference is the back panel doesn't come off and the roof doesn't pop off. Otherwise, it's the same thing. This cab here also has a window that will pop open. And the windshield wiper motor is up here. It also has some auxiliary places for other things. Uh, here I have uh, some rear lights that are installed as an option and some front lights as an option. The front wiper is an option for this cab and the rear wiper which I don't have installed yet but as you can see this is where it would go. I want to show you how easy it is to actually remove the rear panel. First you pop open the roof, piece of cake. Second you go back here, you flip up that little lever and there's one on this side, you flip that lever. Now. We go back here to the back of the tractor and we pull it off just like that. It's a piece of cake. Now, as we go around this cab, I also want you to keep in mind that the hinges are typically known as what's called Jeep hinges. And because it's on Jeep hinges, it makes the door really, really easy to lift out of place and move. 
So now we're inside the Curtis Advantage Series. This is a standard cab, but it has a lot of similar features. As you can see, the front windshield pops open to offer you some ventilations, just as the premium cab version does. But what's missing is you can't access the loader, but that's okay, because you really don't need to. You're gonna probably need to get off your tractor and do it that way. Uh, but it does give you the window, so you can still see what's going on down there. The heater, is over here there's a 20,000 BTU heater that is going to pl put out plenty of heat for you uh, it's going to you know it's going to circulate throughout the entire cab area it has three different vents on it that you can turn and move from side to side and it will still keep you plenty warm <music> Looking at the door, you can see it's got a really large window. The one difference is it doesn't open. So the window doesn't open, but it doesn't really need to. The door opens easy enough. And you open the door and you get into that nice, warm, toasty cab. So if you're looking to add a little ventilation to the Curtis Advantage cab, you can also take this back windshield off. It actually has two functions. I'll show you how they work. First, you can come in here and you can just have the window open just like that. Or there's some levers inside these hinges that will allow you to take that window right off and get it out of the way. Just like that. Now you pretty much have an open cab area with a lot of ventilation and yet you're still protected from the sun. And it's just as easy, if not easier, to remove the doors from this Advantage Series. You open the door, you pull it up, and you're done. So now if you're thinking about a cab for your tractor and you want to stay nice and toasty warm in the winter time because winters are the worst, because they're not that much fun. Or if you're actually thinking about air conditioning, because both of these cabs offer an air conditioning unit. You've got two options to choose from. You've got the premium deluxe model, which is a little spendier, or you've got more of an economical version with the Curtis Advantage series. So look into each of them, see what's right for you. You make the decision. Either way, you're gonna stay warm in the winter time. Mm -hmm.